Welcome to the Black Wealth Channel, where we are committed to educating the Black community on essential financial literacy skills. Today, we explore the concept of abundance and its consequences. Is the abundance we enjoy truly worth it? Let's dive into the cost of abundance, hoping to better understand the implication of our consumeristic ways of life. Cost number one, the loss of connection. In the United States, we have access to an incredible abundance of material possessions. Our lives are filled with gadgets, technology, and material wealth. Yet, as our lives become more comfortable and self-sufficient, we've started to distance ourselves from our neighbors and communities. We no longer feel the need for small talk or close-knit bonds because we have everything we could ever desire at our fingertips. The first cost of abundance is the loss of community. Cost number two, shallow relationships. Our smartphones with their countless apps and social media platforms have given us access to the entire world's knowledge and entertainment. We've become constantly connected but this connectedness can be deceiving. In the world of social media, we can have thousands of friends and followers, but are the relationships deep and meaningful? The second cost of abundance is the superficiality of our relationship. Cost number three, lack of time. Time is one of the most precious resources we have, but our abundance of choices has led to a scarcity of time. Our days are jam-packed with endless options for entertainment, work, and leisure. This leaves us feeling overwhelmed as we struggle to prioritize our time effectively. The third cost of abundance is the depletion of our time. Cost number four, the pursuit of happiness. In a world filled with options, we have become obsessed with the pursuit of happiness. We seek joy in material possessions, thinking that the next purchase will bring us lasting contentment. However, this mindset can lead to a never-ending cycle of consumption that fails to fulfill us. The fourth cost of abundance is the relentless pursuit of happiness through materialism. Cost number five, environmental consequences. Our consumeristic way of life has significant environmental implications. The extraction of natural resources, mass production, and rapid consumption led to deforestation, habitat destruction, and the depletion of our planet's resources. This has dire consequences for the environment. The fifth cost of abundance is the damage we inflict on our planet. Cost number six, an unfulfilling lifestyle. Despite our abundance of possessions, studies show that our national happiness has been steadily declining. We have more than ever before, yet we lack the time for the things that genuinely make us happy, like spending time with loved ones. The sixth cost of abundance is an unfulfilling and hurried lifestyle. Cost number seven, a distracted life. Abundance has led to an overwhelming amount of information and options. We are constantly distracted by news stories, television programs, and the endless scroll of social media. This constant bombardment of content makes it challenging to focus and truly be present. The seventh cost of abundance is a perpetually distracted life. Cost number eight, the loss of hope. In Greek mythology, when Pandora opened the box, all the evils of the world were released. However, one thing remained inside, hope. Hope is a powerful force that carries us through challenging times. In a world filled with challenges resulting from abundance, it's essential to hold on to hope. So is abundance truly worth it? That's a question only you can answer. While we can't provide definitive answers to those complex questions, 
it's crucial to acknowledge the cost we pay for our materialistic, consumer-driven lifestyles. It's a collective responsibility to reflect on whether this path aligns with our values. Despite the formidable challenges that consumerism presents in our lives, there is still a beacon of hope, a shining possibility of transformation that can alter the course of our existence. This hope is grounded in the belief that as individuals and communities, we can come together to collectively make a change. Our collective efforts hold the power to shift the trajectory of society from one driven by relentless consumerism to a new path guided by intention, empathy, and the pursuit of more meaningful values. This hope hinges on the capacity to redefine our priorities and shift our focus from the relentless accumulation of material possessions to seeking fulfillment in experiences, connections, and self-discovery. It is a hope that encourages us to recognize that true happiness and contentment doesn't reside in the latest gadget, fashion trend, or luxury car, but are found in the moments shared with loved ones in the warmth of a kind gesture, and in the beauty of personal growth and creativity. This realization empowers us to reassess our values, allowing empathy and authenticity to take precedence over superficial possessions. Our collective hope is a driving force, urging us to address the challenges we face and pave the way for a more balanced, meaningful way of life. It acknowledges the difficulties and the deeply ingrained consumerist culture that surrounds us, but it also reminds us that change begins with awareness and intention. By fostering understanding and empathy, we can create a society that celebrates individuality, encourages self-expression, and values the quality of our relationships over the quantity of our belongings. As one, we stand at the peak of a profound shift in perspective. We understand that the journey towards a more balanced, meaningful life is not always easy, and it may require us to swim against the current of consumerism that inundates our daily lives. However, our collective hope reinforces our commitment to this change, infusing us with the motivation to prioritize what truly matters. It encourages us to challenge the status quo, to question the never-ending cycle of consumption, and to champion the pursuit of a life rich in purpose, passion, and fulfillment. If you'd like to explore the world of finance, if you'd like to take this concept to another level and learn to better invest what you already have, don't forget to check the description section for a link that offers free stock. Your support through like, comments, and subscriptions is greatly appreciated. Thank you for trusting us with your financial literacy needs. See you in the next video.